Good evening, good morning, good afternoon, wherever you are, whenever you are. Hello. Thanks for watching my videos. It's Mike. It's January 7th, 2009. Very early in the morning. I really should be in bed. Things have been playing on my mind in the last hour, however. I was watching uh, CV1122's Predictions of the Year video, which I found quite interesting, and I will link it here. She made mention of a little project called Webbot, which goes out and trolls things like blog sites and comments on videos and things like that to predict where things are going in the future. Uh, they use very interesting technology, um, very interesting actually, being a software kind of guy. I found this remarkable. They use this thing called set theory. If you want to understand what set theory is, you're probably going to need to find a book like this, Probability and Statistical Inference. I got through the first one okay, but the second one really started twisting my mind. The mathematics in here are is just outrageous. Here, check, check this out. Can you read that? Well, even if you could see it, I seriously doubt you'd understand half of it. I certainly didn't. I made it through one okay. That's pretty logical. But then they started going off into really bizarre stuff that just boggled my mind. And I, I wasn't doing it for a course or anything. I was just reading some books. So, uh, I think I was 20 when I bought this. Shows how old I am. My word. So it's very interesting. You should take a look at that. One of the things that uh, that went to, though, I bounced around a bit after that and read some other things. Um, then I stumbled across an art news article that I'd missed from uh, Tuesday. Uh, actually, Monday, yes. Monday evening. Um, on the BBC News website. It's linked here. Greek unrest takes worrying turn. Greece's worst civil unrest in more than 30 years has taken its most dangerous turn yet. A domestic militant group called Revolutionary Struggle, has now entered the fray. Um, and according to Greek officials, the proof is they found some bullets that were fired at these at the police officers, <clears throat> one of which, who is in, in serious um, critical condition, these bullets came from a weapon that was used in April of 2007 on a gun attack on a police station in Athens. Um, Revolutionary struggle is described as a radical, radical leftist group in a recent U.S. State Department report on terrorism. Uh, previously, the group has also claimed a rocket attack on the U.S. Embassy in Athens in 2007 as well. <clears throat> I told you things were going to get kind of crazy out there. Well, it's starting far sooner than anyone expected. Um, expect to see this in other countries where there is a wide gap, uh, as mentioned in another article where there is a wide gap between the rich and the poor. Uh, in Britain, fortunately, the rich are getting much poorer, so I don't ex anticipate too much unrest here in Britain, although it wouldn't surprise me at all if something started happening in London. However, uh, be very careful. There's one other thing about uh, Greece that's actually quite important. <clears throat> I mentioned before that uh, Gazprom were threatening to cut off the gas flow through the Ukraine. Well, they did it. Okay, so for those of you in the States that weren't aware of this, uh, Putin basically came out and said, right, we're cutting the gas off 20%. Cut it off. Ukrainians don't care. They've got f at least four months worth of gas in storage for the people in the Ukraine. However, this caught a lot of other countries by surprise. Guess they don't watch me. That's fine. <clears throat> and now... Uh, we are in a crisis situation, the Bulgarian economy minister said in a statement, with temperatures set to fall further this week and consumer demand forecast to rise. Austria is also complaining, and funnily enough, so is Greece. Let me just find the statement here. Sorry, I'm just going to find the next one here. <clears throat> Deliveries of natural gas at the Bulgarian-Romanian frontier for uh, bulgur gas destined for the Bulgarian market, an onward transit towards Greece, Turkey, and Macedonia were stopped at 3.30 a.m. Basically, the gas isn't, being, isn't making it to Greece. Now, fortunately, Greece is only, only uses a, a, approximately 20-30% of its uh, natural gas comes from Russia. But this will no doubt set off other things. Be safe, people. I know there. I, I I know I have viewers in Greece, and in um, and I'll be forwarding this directly onto you. 
please be careful if you're in a major city um, or if you have to be near a major city or a populated area please please be careful peace everyone love understanding keep awake keep watching for things you'll be okay okay thanks bye